Welcome to Half-Life 2. Um, this I have not beaten. Um, I picked up Orange Box on the PC uh, very late in these games. So I already kind of knew that Episode 3 was going to be a no-show. So it kind of disheartened me to actually complete Half-Life 2, let alone to get to Episodes 1 and 2, but it is something I'm going to rectify now. So yeah, uh, I looked on Steam and it appears the last time I played this was in 2013. So it's been a while, but I don't think this game needs that much of an introduction, so let's get this going. Start new game. Rise and shine, Mr. Freeman. Rise and shine. Not that I wish to imply you have been sleeping on the job. No one is more deserving of a rest, and all the effort in the world would have gone to waste until... Well, let's just say your hour has come again. The right man in the wrong place can make all the difference in the world. So wake up, Mr. Freeman. Wake up and smell the ashes. I hate that guy. Okay, people have been shooting at this train. Point insertion. And as with the first game, we are getting the credits as we start. I didn't see you get on. Uh, yeah, I kind of appeared. What about you? No matter how many times I've been relocated, I never get used to it. Well, end of the line. Welcome. Okay. Welcome to City 17. You have chosen Ow. or been chosen to relocate to one of our finest remaining urban centers. I thought so much of City 17 that I elected to establish my administration here in the Citadel so thoughtfully provided by our benefactors. I've been proud to call City 17 my home. And so, whether you are here to stay or passing through on your way to parts unknown, welcome to City 17. It's safer here. Okay, so we're at City 17. I don't know, I'm not liking the look. I mean, big... Hey, I shot lots of you. Okay, this is going to be strange. And I don't like you. Put this stuff, it's all I have left. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome to City All right, I'm moving. 17. Jeez. You have chosen or been chosen to relocate to one of our finest remaining urban centers. Were you the only I ones on so that much train? Of City 17 that I elected to establish my administration here. In Overwatch the stopped our train in the woods and took my husband for questioning. They said I've he'd be on the next train. City I'm not home. sure when that was. And so, Did there, there be nice, though, letting me wait for him? Passing through on your way to parts unknown, welcome to City 17. Okay, I'm getting bored of that guy. But she's waiting for someone. Ah, uh, here. Got you a drink for whilst you wait. Uh-huh. Oh, balls. Um. 
Anyone want a drink? Welcome, Doctor Brain again. Welcome to I was hoping I'd seen the last of him in City 14. I didn't say that too loud. This is his base of operations. I thought so. Much I wasn't listening at all. That I Not at all. My administration here in the Citadel so thoughtfully provided. Okay, so we're in a train station. And the ones that do arrive, they, they never leave. You never see them go. They're and always so, full. whether you are here to stay or... I see they took your suitcase too. They can't get away with this much longer. Welcome. Got no body, so I can't see what I look like. Don't drink the water. They put something in it to, to make you forget. I don't even remember how I got here. Okay. Wow. No, no, never mind. It was the reflections making it look like it was full. Oh, this is running good. Okay. This is where video games are silly because you really wouldn't walk backwards. Welcome. Welcome to City 17. You have chosen or been chosen to... Okay. So I've got to go in here, have I? I thought so much of City 17. That I elected to step uh, what's up? Uh huh. Okay. Our benefactors. I've been proud to call. Can't use. My home. So, this must be a mistake. I got a standard relocation coupon just like everybody else. Going more on the side details. There we go. So. Stood in front of the charts, they can take my picture. Hang on. Let me get rid of the bucket. There we go. About that beer I owed you. It's me, Gordon. Barney from Black Mesa. Hey, sorry for the scare. I had to put on a show for the cameras. I've been working undercover with civil protection. I can't take too long or they'll get suspicious. I'm way behind on my beating quota. Yes, Barney, what is it? I'm in the middle of a critical test. Sorry, Doc, but look who's here. Great Scott! Gordon Freeman! I expected more warning. Yeah, you and me both, Doc. He was about to board the express to Nova Prospect. Well, Barney, what do you intend? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Alex is around here somewhere. She would have a better idea how to get him here. Well, as long as he stays away from checkpoints, we should be okay. Listen, I've okay. got to go, Doc. We're taking enough chances as it is. Very well. And, uh, Gordon, good to see you. Okay, Gordon. You're going to have to make your own way to Dr. Kleiner's lab. Oh, man, that's what I was afraid of. Get in here, Gordon, before you blow my cover. Oh, blue shift. Get through that window and keep going till you're in the plaza. I'll meet up with you later. But yes, blue shift. Barney. Almost called him Barney Rubble, which would have been wrong. Uh, well. Physics is much better than the last one. But I think that's a given. So... Whoop. And there we go. That did the trick. Door. Okay. We can deal with the door. Okay, that's going to be annoying. Can't go through there. Must be up here. Oh. Seem fit to suppress our reproductive cycle. Sincerely. Yes, sir. Thank you for my concern. Of course, your question touches on one of the basic biological impacts. Um, I'll keep out of your way, sir. I also detect some unspoken questions. Do our benefactors really know what's best for us? 
What You'll have to wait your turn like everybody else. Kind of decision I don't know about you, but I'm ready to join civil protection we'll just to get a decent meal. Activate the suppression field and let us breed again. Wait a minute, you said something about suppression field? The anxiety is underlying your concerns, rather than try to answer every possible question you might have left on voice. First, let us consider the fact that for the first time ever, as a species, immortality is in our reach. This simple fact has far-reaching implications. It requires radical rethinking and revision of our genetic imperatives. It also requires planning and forethought that run in direct opposition to our neural precepts. I find it helpful at times like these to remind myself that our true enemy is instinct. Instinct was our mother when we were an infant species. Instinct coddled us and kept us safe in those hard scrabble years when we hardened our sticks and cooked our first meals above a meager fire and started at the shadows that leapt upon the cavern's walls. But inseparable from instinct is its dark twin, superstition. Instinct is inextricably bound to unreasoning impulses. And today we clearly see its true nature. Instinct has just become aware of its irrelevance. And like a cornered beast... I think he can keep going. Word to the wise, keep it to yourself. Injury on our species. Okay. Instinct creates its own oppressors and bids us rise up against them. Instinct tells us that the unknown is a threat rather than an opportunity. Instinct smiley and covert terminal hotel change and progress. Instinct therefore XCCR. It must be fought tooth and urges. Wow, it's strange. I got way too used to tessellation in video games. This overpowering force. They have thrown a switch. But it is but, uh, not that way. Got to avoid those things. But for its time, this game... I mean, about the same time this game was coming out, um, Crisis was either about to be released or just had been released, so... It gives you some sort of parallels in regards to... Don't think I like what's going on there. Definitely don't like what's going on there. Guess this way? Hey, didn't crush it this time. Definitely don't want to go that way. But yeah. So, it kind of gives you a parallel. At the time that this game was released, if you push the graphics, you get Crisis. However, this game was fairly polished. Always starts. First the building, then the whole block. They have no reason to come to our place. But don't worry, they'll find one. So yes, I mean, both games. Were examples of the time that they was created. Both with different methods in regards to how they wanted to achieve things. Um, this would go more on what I'd call linear play level, whilst Crisis tried being open world. It's definitely interesting playing these games. Ow, ah, ee, ooh. Definitely interesting seeing these games side by side. Yay! I actually timed that about right. Doesn't look good for me. Got no 
flashlight. Okay, let's go up. Okay, I agree with you. Oh, I thought you were a cop. He's one of us. I also detect some Look at him down there. I told you they'd be coming for us next. Just this one time. You're wrong. Okay, let's move on from there. I can't take it anymore. Something's gonna be okay. Attention, resident. Oh god. Miscount detected in your block. Cooperation with your civil protection team. Hey you! Permit in here! Right okay. Reward. Head for the roof! There's no time to lose! Okay. Attention. No pressure, huh? Oh, pressure. Get in here, quick! Keep moving, head for the roof! Can... Can do. Ooh, pistol shot. That's not good. Just some cans. Wood splintering, that's never good. Uh, this seems like the way. What am I on about? Of course, it's the way I'm, I've played this many times. Well, this bit. Uh, just, if they could stop shooting, that would be great. Uh-huh. Oh god. Oh god. Ow. Uh. Ha, no you don't. <laughs> Dr. Freeman, I presume. <clears throat> we better hurry. The Combine can be slow to wake, but once they're up, you don't want to get in their way. No go. Uh -huh. Dr. Kleiner said you'd be coming this way. <laughs> I don't think it occurred to him that you might not have a map. I'm Alex Vance. My father worked with you back in Black Mesa. I'm sure you don't remember me, though. Oh. A few words, aren't you? Uh-huh. I'm the original silent protagonist. Remember him from Black Mesa? Your old administrator. <laughs> Don't get my dad started on Dr. Breen. Through here. Neat. Gods. Funny, Got you're showing up on this day in particular. Whee. We've been helping people escape the city on foot. It's a dangerous route to my father's lab through the old canals. Today, we're finally on the verge of having a better way. Uh-huh. <laughs> Here, let me buy you a drink. Okay. Um, one drink? Oh, and by the way... Ah. Nice to finally meet you. Things. Where did she get to? Lamar, come out of there! Uh-oh, everything all right, Dr. Kleiner? Oh, uh, hello, Alex. Well, uh, almost all right. Lamar has gotten out of her crate again. If I didn't know better, I'd suspect Barney of trapping and... My goodness, Gordon Freeman. It really is you, isn't it? I found him wandering around outside. Bit of a troublemaker, isn't he? We owe a great deal to Dr. Freeman, even if trouble does tend to follow in his wake. I must say, Gordon, you come at a very opportune time. 
Alex has just installed the final piece for our resurrected teleport. I can't take any credit for the breakthrough, Doctor. Nonsense. Your talents surpass your loving. <laughs> Let's just see if this thing works, okay? Well, is it here? There you are. Man, Gordon, you stirred up the hive. We can't keep him here long, Doc. It'll jeopardize everything we've worked for. Don't worry. He's coming with me. Uh, that's right, Barney. This is a red-letter day. We'll inaugurate the new teleport with a double transmission. You mean it's working? Ooh. For real this time? Because I still have nightmares about that cat. No, no. There's nothing to be nervous what about. Cat? We've made major strides since then. Major strides. What cat? Doc, since he's not taking the streets, you might as well get him out of his civvies. What? Oh, dear. You're right. I almost forgot. Barney, I'll give you the honor. I've got to get back on my ship, but okay. My Here suit! Ah, damn it! Get it off me! Lamar! There you are! I thought you got rid of that pest. Certainly not. Never fear, Gordon. She's de-beaked and completely harmless. The worst she might do is attempt to couple with your head fruitlessly. Get that thing away from me! Here, my pet. Up, up. No, not up there. No, no. Careful, Lamar. Those are quite fragile. Oh, fie. It'll be another week before I can coax her out of there. Yeah, longer if we're lucky. <laughs> Barney! You're not an animal person. Ugh. Well, Gordon, go ahead. Slip into your suit now. This is the last suit I'll ever wear. I see your HEV suit still fits you like a glove. At least <coughs> the gloves do. I've made a few modifications, but I'll just acquaint you with ancient essentials. Now, let's see. <clears throat> the Mark V hazardous environment suit has been redesigned for comfort and utility. Oh, dear. Doc, we don't have time for this. At least get that suit juiced up, Gordon. Good idea. There's a charger on the wall. Well, that looks pretty. I've modified your suit to draw power from combine energy outlets, which are plentiful wherever they patrol. So well, let's get this show on the road. Whoop. I do wonder if Valve updated the textures over time. We that was quick. Gordon, why don't you position yourself near the panel over there and wait for my word? Isaac, are you there? Yes, yes, Eli. Bit of a holdup on this end. You'll never guess who found his way into our lab this morning. Uh, that's not who I think it is, is it? Indeed it is. And it's our intention to send him packing straight away in the company of your lovely daughter. Are you ready for us, Dad? You're all set on this end. Then let's do it. Let's see. The massless field flux should self-limit, and I've clamped the manifold parameters to base and LT orbifold. No conditions. Conditions could hardly be more ideal. That's what you said last time. Hey, uh, yeah, about that cat. Visualizing. Yeah, about the cat. Two, one. No fixes. What? It's okay. I fixed it. Ahead. Very good. Final sequence. Amazing. They should be pretty. Now, I can't look. Uh, <laughs> okay. Oh, it's well, did it work? See for yourself. Hey, Doc. Goodness. Yay! It's almost palpable. Fantastic work, Izzy. Well, I can't take all the credit. Dr. Freeman proved an able assistant. 
I flicked a switch and plugged something back in. Right you are. Speak to you again in a few moments. Good job, Gordon. Throwing that switch and all. I can see your MIT education really pays for itself. All right, Barney. Your turn. Gee, thanks. Gordon, as soon as you're in position, we'll send you to Eli's. And not a moment too soon. Oh, it's me. Sorry. Should I keep all limbs inside the apparatus at Visualize. the time of operation? Three, two, one. Uh, Barney, if you'll be so kind. Good luck out there, Gordon. Yes, indeed. You're our only hope. Project you, Gordon. Bon voyage and best of luck in your future endeavors. Final sequence. What hell? What is it? It's your head helper again. Head helper. Be free, little monster. What's going on, Judith? I'm not sure. It seems to be some kind of interference. Gordon, hey, Gordon, you get you out of there. Something is drawing him away. What's the meaning of this? Who are you? How did you get in here? Hey, hey, hey. I'm getting out of here. Head enough weed into the field, it will peel you apart. Just lost Gordon. What's going on? I will try to. I'm encountering unexpected interference. Don't worry, Gordon. We'll... There he is. Oh, we're losing it again. I'm all but certain it was Gordon, Gordon Freeman. Ah, uh, water isn't a good place. Dear God, no. He didn't come through. Then where is he? Behind you. Shut it down. Shut it down. Gordon, you must get out of here. Get down out of sight. I'll come find you. Okay, we're officially boned. And we got things are making me blind. Would you stop that, please? Ow. No, throwing a box at them didn't help. Ah. Uh, that appears to be the way to go. But, you know, I figure they should give me a crowbar or something. Okay, it appears or oh, something is off the menu. How about up here? Door sound. Right, my bet is within the next five seconds, loading screen. Damn, I'm good at this. Uh huh. Hey, Gordon! The Citadel's on full alert. I've never seen it lit up like that. Get out of City 17 as fast as you can, Gordon. Take the old canals, right? They'll get you to Eli's lab. It's, it's a dangerous route, but there's a whole network of refugees, and they'll help you if they can. I'd come with you, but I gotta look after Dr. Kleiner. Oh, and before I forget, I think you dropped this back in Black Mesa. Good luck out there, buddy. You're gonna need it. There it is. The man of science that wields a crowbar is one to be feared. Unless you have bullets and then I will run.